Chapter 53 The Sparkling Star Quest As the golden sun dipped below the horizon in Everbright, bathing the kingdom in the warm hues of twilight, Prince Leo, Princess Amelia, Drizzle, and their friends found themselves by the enchanting Stardust Lake. It was known across the enchanted realm that Stardust held immense magic, and its sparkle could make the impossible come true. The latest addition to their magical companions was Starla, a graceful unicorn with a sparkling mane that mimicked the shimmer of the night sky. Starla had the unique gift of collecting stardust from the crystal clear waters of the lake. The stardust was crucial to maintaining the balance and enchantment of the enchanted world. And tonight, a problem arose. Look at the lake, Drizzle said, peering at the reflection of the starry sky in the water. The stars have dimmed. Something's wrong. Sure enough, the reflection of the stars was fainter than usual, and it filled their hearts with concern. The entire realm depends on the radiance of these stars, Prince Leo remarked. Starla, the unicorn, dipped her horn into the lake, trying to gather stardust, as she always did. To her dismay, it trickled down to mere droplets. I don't understand, Starla said her silver eyes filled with worry. The stars have faded in the sky, and their magic wanes. Princess Amelia, always the empathetic one, said, the stars are more than just a pretty sight. They hold the wishes, dreams, and hopes of everyone in the enchanted world. The group knew they had to investigate. With Starla leading the way, they set off towards Starfall Peak, a towering mountain with a mystical aura. It was said that atop Starfall Peak lay the legendary Starforge, the source of stardust. Their journey was fraught with funny mishaps and laughter, like Drizzle's hilarious attempt to blend in with the night sky. Finally, they reached the peak, and there they encountered Luna, the guardian of the Starforge, an ancient owl with eyes that glistened like the stars. Luna explained that the celestial balance was disrupted due to a star-struck comet, which had caused the stardust to deplete rapidly. But Luna, Starla, Prince Leo, Princess Amelia, Drizzle, and their friends were not the kind to give up. With a plan that was as daring as it was hilarious, they devised a way to guide the comet safely through the sky, ensuring that it would not consume all the stardust. Their plan involved a comical relay race of magical creatures and a sky chase that ended with a skyward splash. Their mission was a success, and the comet continued on its celestial journey. The sky began to fill with stars once more, their brilliance reigniting the hopes and dreams of the enchanted world. As they returned to Stardust Lake, where the waters now shimmered with renewed stardust, they realized that the adventure had strengthened their bonds of friendship, highlighted the importance of teamwork, and taught them that the power of laughter and a touch of magic could overcome even the most. Celestial Challenges With the stardust replenished, the world of magic remained in balance, and Starla the unicorn, with a mane that shone like stardust, was a hero. The gang sat by the sparkling lake, gazing up at the stars, feeling grateful for the magical world they called home. But their adventures were far from over, for the enchanted world was vast, and many more magical mysteries awaited. To be continued. Thanks a bunch for sharing this adventure with us. We had a blast, and we hope you did too. Remember to give that like button a friendly tap and hit the subscribe button, so you won't miss out on more fantastic tales and giggles. Can't wait to see you again soon for another round of storytime fun. Thank you.